Welcome to this week's sports update. I'm Andrew McClung. Welcome. Uh, it was an eventful week in sports as football won again, keeping their chances alive for an ODAC championship. At Fred Self Stadium Saturday, the Wasps were taking on the Catholic Cardinals. Let's get it started with 541 in the first quarter. Wasps trailing by seven. Sam Wagner ran, runs it up the gut to even things up at seven. With little time remaining in the second quarter and the score tied at 14, Catholic was knocking on the door of the Wasp, but Trey Lightfoot would step in front of a pass and take it 102 yards back to the house for an Emory touchdown. The Wasp would go on to win the game 38-27. to To win the ODAC Championship Saturday, the Wasp will need to beat Guilford and for Randolph-Macon to lose to Hampton City. EHC Volleyball was at the ODAC Tournament Wednesday uh, in Lynchburg, where the 60 to Wasp were facing the third-seeded Hornets of Lynchburg College. After winning the first set, the Wasps will drop the next three sets to lose the match. Ali Singleton led the Wasps in kills with 14. Also on Saturday, four Wasps were named to the All-ODAC team. Junior Ali Singleton was named to the All-ODAC second team, and seniors Tristan Pennington, Emily Henshaw, Kennedy Thompson and were named third team selections. Diving from the volleyball court into the pool, the women's swim team faced Farham this past Saturday in an exciting meet. Holly Roth, Jessica Richardson, Olivia Anson, and Michaela Nolte all won, a, all won events as the Wasps floated by the competition with a final score of 124-36. That will do it for your sports update this week. Andrew McClung, EHC 